instituted a final eight this year, which the Rugby League is looking at perhaps putting into place for their own competition next year or the year after. The final eight, well, it certainly is a mystery. Here to help unravel it, please make welcome Peter Crackers Keenan. Thanks, Sal. There's only one way to find out about the final eight, and that's to come to Swinburne and ask a mathematician. Professor Clark, explain the eight to me. Because a lot, a lot of people out there, like, never got past grade six plats, to see. Well, <laughs> you know, I, we're struggling. I think they'll find, once it, once it gets going, it's really like two double fours. Where's, where's the best place to be? The well, best place to be is top first or second. Even if you're a good team, it's going to be very hard to win from eight because you're going to have to win four matches in a row. So if I say to you it's just the AFL making money and just keeping us not so smart people in the dark, you'd agree? Oh, I don't know whether I'd agree with that, but uh, they've, they've worked out a system that uh, gives everybody some chance of winning, but uh, I think the big problem is your chance of winning depends on matches that you're not playing in. Now listen, is there any chance of having dead finals? The league have got to be very careful that they play match four versus five and three versus six early in the series. They can't afford to leave those matches till the end. Why? Because if they leave them to the end and uh, let's say teams one and two win, yeah. then that means that uh, one and two will get the bye and seven and eight, uh, West Coast and Carton will get the bye. Melbourne and Collingwood would be eliminated. So don't say things like that. But just, yes, talk about just and, dismissed. And, and so the other match doesn't do anything. Whatever happens, whether a team wins or loses, they will still go into the semi-final. So you just whack your seconds in and go around and play a practice game. If you wanted to avoid perhaps West Coast or some other team, you might even be in your interest to lose. So you might be trying to lose the game. We've blown the whistle on something here, Professor. When we go to the police, they, are the police aware of this dead final business or not? Well, How can we get Collingwood to win it? Well, Carlton are the favourites, according to the computer at the moment. Exactly. Closely followed by North Melbourne. I've got, really could, I've got a way we could do it. I've got a way we could do it. You've got get a Collingwood way, up. have you? The Keenan system. It never fails. Professor, underneath one of these cups, is a gold coin representing the Premiership Cup. Now I want you to close your eyes and I'll just move them around a little bit so you can sort of have a look. No people there, of course. As soon as you put your hand out, you'll find that one of them has the gold coin. Righty, wait a minute, just say the magic words. Lift the cup up. Away you go. One of these cups. Yeah, one of them. This is my system. What's it? What is it? Oh, what is it? Collingwood. There you go. We've won it. Don't even have to fly.